We begin tonight continuing coverage of former ECU interim chancellor Dan Gerlach's resignation. New video shows what looks to be Gerlach walking on uptown Greenville sidewalks on the same night that led to him being placed on leave. Down your side's Madison Force. He's been following this story from the beginning. She joins us now live from ECU's campus with more. Madison. Many of the students that I talked to today on ECU's campus say that they still support Dan Gerlach, and a lot of them were surprised when they got notice of his resignation during the homecoming football game on Saturday. Videos surfacing over the weekend, giving a new look into Dan Gerlach's night out on September 25th. These clips obtained by Nine on Your Side show a man dressed like Gerlach losing his shoe in the middle of the street and struggling to put it back on. He's then seen weaving down the sidewalk outside of Sup Dogs, then gets into a car and drives down 5th Street in the middle of two lanes. This is the latest development in a month-long saga that started when these pictures and videos surfaced of Gerlach in Uptown Greenville bars drinking alongside students. Gerlach's resignation is a big topic on campus, leaving many students wanting answers and thinking he was possibly forced to resign. I don't think Dan would have done that himself. I wish that they would inform us more on the not so much being politically correct about it, but being really honest with the students and if at least just the students. Now students want someone with the same open and welcoming personality they say Gerlach had to take his place. If they bring in someone else, I hopefully think that that person will look at Dan and be like, oh, this person really made an impact by, you know, going into the boneyard at the student section, you know, being on campus during the day, reaching out to students, and hopefully that next person will take those, the, the first couple steps that he was doing to reach out and be a part of the community. After his resignation, Gerlach released a statement that says, in part, I was sent here to reduce the drama that ECU faced, and instead I added to it. I hope that you find it in your hearts to forgive me. I hope also that all of Pirate Nation will focus all energy and vigor towards supporting the ongoing leadership at ECU. The Board of Trustees is set to have a special meeting tomorrow afternoon, and no doubt one topic of conversation will be the continuing process to fill Gerlach's seat. For now, Ron Mitchelson is acting as the interim chancellor of ECU. In Greenville, Madison 4C, 9 on your side.